Hello and welcome back guys. Today's video is Road to Passive Income Episode 2. In this video we're going to look at stocks that I've bought over the last week. In this episode we have made some great progress in building up the portfolio with a great mix of stocks and ETFs. At the moment with the current pandemic finding good value stocks is quite difficult but I do believe I have done a good job of this. I am holding off however a little bit and waiting for the bubble to pop. Just a little bit of a disclaimer before we get into this video. This is not financial advice as I am not a financial advisor. I have purchased these stocks at my own risk and I want to share them with you. BP is the first stock I bought. I increased the value of my portfolio by adding another two shares, giving me a total of five shares with an average price of $26.17. This has me down 7.5% on my investment. I'm going to continue to buy this share and hopefully lower the average cost of my purchase. BP gives me an annual income of $12.60. BP has a dividend yield of 10.43%. They have seven years of dividend growth and I'm sure they'll continue to keep this up. Before going any further, can you please just smash that like button? I'd greatly appreciate it. It'll help me grow the channel. And if you could also hit that subscribe button, it should be just about here. And let's continue on with the video and get into the next share I purchased, AT&T. AT&T has a current price of $29.64. I bought four shares of this at an average price of $31.01, leaving me down 4% on my investment. AT&T is a company that I like the way they're going and believe they could show great potential in the future with 5G on the way. It is another stock that I'm down on, but I'm definitely going to try and average out my cost per share. AT&T have a dividend of 6.88% and have been increasing their dividend over the last 35 years. I believe that they will continue to do this and that is one of the big reasons why I have invested in this company. My next share is the Div ETF. I bought them for an average price of $16.07 and a total of 11 of them, giving me an income of $19 a year. I'm currently down 6% on this and have full confidence that it will recover. It has a dividend yield of 11.5% and this is my third ETF in my portfolio. As you can see from the growth, it had one big year and then it's kind of dropped off a little bit, but it's slowly grown the last three years. As you can see, they've got a well diversified portfolio with the majority of their holdings under 3%. As the price continues to go down, I definitely plan on buying more of this share. They do have a few companies that are a bit high risk, but I believe that overall they should be good. That is all I've purchased this week as I believe there is another crash coming soon with a second wave of coronavirus. This gives me a total income of $117 a year and just under $10 a month. I plan to dramatically increase this over the next few months. In these videos, I'm doing a $50 Amazon gift card giveaway. If you have commented on this video and subscribed, you are entered into the giveaway. You can only enter in once per video though. The giveaway will be announced once I hit $300 of annual income. And this brings us to the end of the video. If you have not already liked and subscribed, please do so. It would help me out tremendously. Thank you for watching. See you next time.